Hello and welcome to Tech Boost TV. Today we are going to be looking at the HP Z6G4 workstation. Although other operating systems may work, the ones listed on the screen are certified by the manufacturer to run. Before diving into the technical specifications, let's go over the physical characteristics of the system. The Z6G4 workstation is 17.5 inches tall, 18.3 inches deep, and 6.65 inches wide. Looking at the outside of the system, we can see convenient carrying handles for easier mobility. The Z6G4 offers a few different removable storage options. Its basing configuration has two 3.5 inch hard drive bays and two internal 5.25 inch bay that can be used for extra hard drives or optical drives. It offers one slimline bay for DVD-ROM, DVD-RW, or other optical drives. The motherboard also has two slots for M.2 NVMe drives. The system can support up to two Intel Xeon scalable processors and up to 768GB of 2666 MHz or 2933 MHz memory. The power button is located at the top of the system, which glows when the system is turned on. The front ports of the system include two USB 3.1 Gen 1 Type-A, two USB 3.1 Gen 2 Type-C, one media card reader, and one headset microphone input. Moving along to the back, note the rear power supply and power plug. The HP Z6G4 supports a 1000 watt power supply with two 8 or 6 pin graphics connectors. The back of the system has the following ports, one audio line in, one audio line out, two legacy PS2 ports, two 1 gigabit Ethernet LAN ports, and six USB 3.1 Gen 1 Type A. Also note the two slots for optional HP dual port 10 gigabit base T NIC modules. To open the system, lift the latch found on the side and remove the cover. We can now explore the internal components. The two 3.5 inch hard drive trays can be accessed near the front of the system. The hard drives are installed into these trays. With the appropriate adapters, the 3.5 inch trays can be converted for use with 2.5 inch SSDs. The HP Z6G4 supports up to four 2.5 inch or 3.5 inch drives, including SATA, SAS, and up to two PCIe M.2 NVMe SSDs. The system has a 6 gigabit per second integrated Intel chipset SATA controller with six SATA ports, plus one dedicated port for optical drives, and can support RAID 0, 1, and 10. Additional RAID options are available through the use of other RAID controllers. The motherboard has the following PCIe slots, two PCIe Gen 3 X16, three PCIe Gen 3 X4, one PCIe Gen 3 X8, and two M.2 PCIe X4. PCIe Gen 3 slots are typically used for video cards. Please note the system comes with two 8-pin power connectors that can easily be converted to 6-pin. The system also has an optional mounting bracket designed to secure larger video cards. The HP Z6G4 can support up to three 75-watt cards, or up to two 180-watt cards, or one 250-watt card, depending on the system configuration. The supported video cards are listed on the screen. The motherboard has one CPU socket, but an additional processor can be added with the use of a second CPU riser kit. The system can support one or two first or second generation Intel Xeon scalable processor CPUs with up to 28 cores per processor. There are a total of six DDR4 DIMM slots on the motherboard, with six more available on the second CPU riser kit. The slots support both 2666 MHz and 2933 MHz registered DIMMs. With select CPUs, each slot can support up to 64 gigs for a total of 768GB of RAM with dual processors. Please ensure you are using one of the memory configurations shown on the screen for optimal memory bandwidth, and check out our Z6G4 memory installation guide for more tips. All in all, the HP Z6G4 is one of the best mid-range workstations that can handle demanding applications, especially for VFX and rendering. Please check out our how-to videos covering processor, RAM, hard drive, and video card installations, as well as general product overviews for this and other systems. If you have found this helpful, please hit the like and subscribe buttons below. We welcome suggestions on how to make these more useful, so please don't be shy requesting more content.